let's create our first report in which using visualization let's create our first chart let's take first table i just need to click from in table it will create a one icon of table here in table i can add a multiple value which can represent in as per column wise for example if i want to view a product wise total gross profit earned it will reflect me a product wise gross profit additionally if i want to see how many units are sold i can also see if you can see it is reflecting as per column wise for example if i add a revenue uh, region also in the same chart if i want to add a region it will add a new column and it will show me a region wise region wise total gross profit earned and unit it is created a multiple lines for that if i want to view a report as per multiple criteria i need to use a matrix table for that i need to click on blank canvas and click on matrix if in case i will select the same table and click on matrix it will apply the logic on the same table that's the reason let's undo the process and click on a blank canvas so it will create a new mat uh, new charts new visualization let's select and click on matrix it's created a new area now here i will add in row label first product i want a product and in product i want to view total gross profit and now i want to see this report as per region wise so i'll drag the region in column area so if you can see this report in the first table when i insert region it is created a one new column and create a multiple lines but in matrix table it is work as a pivot table and created view for me where i can view each category of product as per region wise now i'll uh, let's go to the another one not create another visualization for that i will select a stack bar chart and i want to reflect a product wise gross profit in bar chart is it is showing me the product wise gross profit and now let's create a funnel chart click on a back then blank canvas click on funnel chart in funnel chart i want to view a total revenue and total cost of goods sold and total gross profit if you can see it is giving me the overall result of how many total revenue earned and how many cost of goods sold and the actual gross profit is 22% of overall total revenue i also view this by a gag chart i will add one more chart gag chart in which i want to view a percent of gross profit so if you can see it will show me the percentage of gross profit i want to create few more charts for that i will create a one new sheet here i want to represent a waterfall chart in waterfall chart i want to present total sales as per fiscal period wise total gross of gross profit it will show me the overall profit earned as per quarter wise and the next i want to view 
a pie chart in pie chart i want to see a region wise gross profit for that i want i just need to select region from a sales representative tab and gross profit now i will create one more donut chart in donut chart i want to represent profit gross profit earned by a sales re uh, representative for that i will select a sales representative and total gross profit so it will give me the overall result now we have covered most of the charts let's rename the sheet name here we have represented a gross profit gross profit by product and the second one we have created gross profit by region we can also add a slicer this is a slicer button just select blank canvas and click on slicer In slicer, I will select a region. Region. And I will I will add one more slicer. Of sales representative. I've created two slicer here. And in the first table, first report. I want to represent a slicer for product. So I will add so add a slicer, and I want to reflect as by product. Now, from this first table, I will remove the extra field of total unit and region. And I will adjust the size and I will move this slicer below here in the first first report we have seen a table table where we have taken a product and represent product wise total gross profit we have added a matrix table in matrix table we have seen a region wise uh, product gross profit we have added up we have added a chart bar chart which represent a product wise gross profit added funnel chart which represent total revenue total cost of goods sold and total gross profit we have added a gag chart which represent a percentage of gross profit from overall total revenue now the second report we have represented a gross profit by region in which we have seen a waterfall chart in which we have represented a total gross profit by fiscal period a waterfall chart is represent a increment by every year every quarter the same way if you can see the total amount it would be a same as overall fiscal year quarter we have additionally created our total gross profit by region, a pie chart, one donor chart which represent a sales representative wise gross profit, a pie chart represent as per region wise. We have added two slices of region wise and sales representative wise. So we on selection of a slicer, overall other charts will be changed. So if I select region of Midwest, if you can see it will represent uh, in our pie chart and donor chart and waterfall chart of the data of gross profit by region of Midwest. We also can view 
a particular sales representative name will give data for only particular sales representative range as per region wise if you click on this button it will clear the selection same we have added one slicer of product now let's create one more report let's rename the sheet name as average daily gross profit now to represent this first i will select a matrix tab matrix table and i will represent a product wise average daily gross profit from product table i will select product and from fact transaction table i will select average daily gross profit you can see on row label it is reflecting product and on values it is reflecting average daily gross profit now uh, if you want to increase the size you can do that go to the format tab select row header increase the size let's make it 12 can also increase the size of header now I will apply a conditional formatting in daily's gross profit to represent which is the highest value for that I can add a condition just select a table go to the filter and select conditional formatting select data bar you can change the color also just select the table through the format conditional formatting uh, data bar just below click on advanced control here the options are available select any color click it ok this way you can apply a different color also why we have used a matrix because matrix see a specific number detail and we have used a data bar with a conditional formatting to get the quick visualize impression to find out which is the highest value of total gross profit sale as per product now let's create our next visualization we need to create a hierarchy hierarchy are multiple fields grouped together for example region and sales representative the benefit of a hierarchy are hierarchy allow us to drag a single item to a visualization and have a single item display in multiple fields with hierarchy we can also drill down in visualization now the cluster chart is representing data as per region wise there is an option available here if you can click on this button this icon now it is enable the drill down option now if i select any region and click it once it will drill down to sales representative field and show the data as per sales representative wise if i want to drill up i need to just click on this icon now the next icon the two below arrow if i click it once it will show us the data as per the all the sales representative wise now let's drill up now if you click on hierarchy it will show the data as per region wise and also as per sales representative wise now i want to represent this data and apply a conditional formatting you just need to select a format And on data color apply conditional formatting select a rule 
if the value is greater than for example approx 450 or less than 800 then make it this color okay now we will add a line chart to represent average gross profit as per fiscal period just select the line chart and drag fiscal period into x axis axis level and drag average daily gross profit in value it will create a line chart now we want to represent a multiple card to show total revenue and total gross profit cost of goods sold and percent of gross profit for that i just selected multiple row card and i will select total revenue total cost of goods sold total gross profit and percent of gross profit from f transaction table now i will format it first i will remove the show bar i don't want to represent i will change the background color and i will apply i will increase the size of category same for a data label if you want to increase the size you can do that now let's resize it our first dashboard is almost the first report is almost ready now let's see how the matrix table will interact with other charts and multi cards just select the matrix table and click on format and click on edit interaction now if you can see 